off the beaten path. I, I just want your perspective on this. Hunter Renfro, of course, he's a college football legend and, of course, a legend in Clemson for what he did. But I think he may have largely gotten dismissed when he went to the pros as, well, he's a great college player. It doesn't really translate. We'll see what he does there. Um, and the only reason this comes to mind is the Raiders are going to the playoffs. I just watched him play the other night. Big win against uh, one of the best NFL games I've seen in a long time against uh, the Chargers. That was a heck of a game down to the wire. They went to overtime. And uh, then I saw a big article. I didn't read it, but I saw a big article in one of the major sites about Hunter Renfro being a star at the NFL. This guy is he's a he's a major star in the NFL. I he, he helped. He was one of the biggest reasons I won my fantasy league this year. <laughs> <I> mean, <laughs> okay. But uh, no, seriously, I would I would say that Hunter Renfro, if he's not the best route runner in the NFL, he's definitely one of the best. Um, yeah, like you said, he just kind of came out of nowhere. You know, he was a walk on at Clemson, but you know, by the time he left, everybody knew who he was. Nobody knew how that translated into the NFL because you know he's not your typical receiver size wise, and, and you know he's he's not as fast as the next guy, but he's so precise in his route running. I mean, he he is so precise, and that's what sets him apart. I, I saw a route he ran in that game you were talking about against the um, Chargers where he, he made, you know, he he faked left, faked right, then faked back. It was three fakes, and, and it was so precise and just left the defender kind of sitting there with his hands on his hips. It, it was just amazing to watch. Um, It's taken, you know, a couple years in the NFL, but he's finally starting to get his due. Kind of got the snub not making the Pro Bowl originally this year should have been in well i think he's got more than 100 catches this year um yep. not many not, not many players have done that in raiders history tim brown maybe one other guy definitely think he got snubbed out of the pro bowl um but it, it's taken a couple of years but he is finally starting to earn his respect in the nfl no doubt about it and this it's been fun to watch caught 49 and 56 passes his first two years and of course Derek carr developing into a better quarterback. So that has something to do with his explosion this year. 103 catches, 1,000 yards, nine touchdowns. Yeah, I, I was being serious when I said he helped me win my fantasy league this year. I mean, he was a – I could – I'll never forget on the draft day, you know, I, I just happened to notice he was still out there two or three rounds left in the draft. Nobody taking him. I was like, wait a minute, I got to get him. <laughs> sure enough, it paid off big time. There you go. And the Raiders onto the playoffs.